Um, uh, my, my statement is merely about, which is what I tried to make clear today, uh, that there is a finite life of all fixed wire technology. So the first thing I want to say is, I think almost everybody in the industry agrees, even the real wireless advocates, you know, such as the Reg Kurtz and others, say you need both fibre and wireless. Wireless just can't do it on its own. It just simply can't. Physically, it can't. Um, so you need both, um, both fibre infrastructure for the next 50 years, and, you, and wireless is going to keep going. We need both. It's very, very difficult for the private sector to build a nationwide fibre infrastructure. I think it's important these days for those people who are making decisions to, to ha at least understand the, um, the fundamentals. Now, nobody, we shouldn't expect people to understand Maxwell's equations, but um, we, we, you know, the, the broad rudiments of what it is that this can deliver and how it can deliver on, the same way as people you know, should understand bridges and um, you know, roads, what it takes to do that, and rails. It's, I think it's the same piece of very important infrastructure. We haven't studied in detail, but it's in the orders of, uh, as you would expect, a few hundred million.